Well, I used to live nearby. Before the war, I mean, uh, up there. I was on the train when it happened. I tried calling my family, but couldn't get through. What the? What happened? Shit! 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 What's going on here? Wake up, Artyom. It's me, Khan. Nightmares, eh? No wonder, after all you've been through. Listen, I have incredible news. A couple of days ago, I was near the ruins of the Dark One's hive, and I saw one of them, still alive. I immediately set out to find you, as you were the one they tried to contact, before you launched the missile strike against them. Khan! How the hell did you get here? Get out! Now! Yes, Ullman, one moment. If a Dark One has survived, it is vital that you try to speak with it, Artyom. I realize that, as one of the Order now, you report to Miller. But we must persuade him to allow this mission. Khan, I told you to get out! This is a classified base. You shouldn't even be here. I'll take you to Colonel Miller. Follow me, Artyom. Get ready, Artyom. I'll be waiting at the exit. Move it, you windbag! I knew a smoker once. During the last year of his life, he had to eat, drink, and breathe through a tiny hole in his throat. We found this place a while ago, but they still can't get used to it. <laughs> Strange place, this D6. I didn't know they ever built bunkers. Привет, Артём. Артём was one of the men who found D6. They gave him a ranger's badge on the spot. Yeah, that's nice for him. I had to spend two years as a cadet before they accepted me into the order. Well, anyway, uh, where were we? The story is, construction started in Stalin's time, yeah, when Tom until the USSR broke down. Oh, man. The war so was inevitable, like I said. Outside. The people who lived in the Come on, you got five more seconds. Look at those two rookies. Yeah. rookies. Pathetic. Doing good. No wonder the colonel ordered the training time double. Shabbat. Move Shabbat. So his squad is sent through the marshes to the George base. And Romanov's the only one who makes it their life. You're shitting me. Rest of the group, my family. Hello, Artyom. Welcome to the armory. I hear you are a ranger now, huh? We must get a drink sometime to celebrate. For now, let's get you equipped. So, first things first. You're going to need a gas mask. You can't make a step on the surface without a gas mask. It's been 20 years and the radiation still strong enough in some places to boil water. There are hot spots down here in the metro, too. Don't forget filters for the mask. Sure, it looks cool enough even without these, but they definitely make it better for your health. Now, med kids. Well, what can I say? Anything you need for survival in a stylish orange case. Here's your advance salary for this month. Remember, your pay is in military-grade rounds. Sure, you can use them as usual ammo for some hefty extra damage, but saving them to buy guns, attachments, regular ammo and equipment from merchants anywhere in the metro seems like a smarter move. <laughs> All right, now to the good stuff, huh? Let's get you some guns. Take the ones you want and try them out on my range. Rangers usually carry up to three weapons, Artyom. The choice of those is completely up to you. Ah, good choice. The Kalash of the workhorse of 
the ranger out. All right, Archer. Go to my range and try out those guns. Come back if you want to try a different gun. Hey, Archer, what on the show for me, huh? Try out the rest of the weapons you chose. about Lesnitsky? What are you Let talking about? Here. Check Moment with the guards at the lab. <sighs> Shit. What the hell did he do? Syria, opening up. All right, let's go. The tombs of ancient kings were filled with whatever they might need in the afterlife. Weapons, gold, chariots. They'd sacrifice their wives and slaves to serve their lords even in death. Reminds me of this bunker. Cut that shit out! The things in D6 are like what the Conqueror took with him beyond the grave. Gold steel and wild steeds and treasures untold. Of course, the Tomb Raiders would always die horribly. Killed by demons or ghosts. Or their own greed. Come, will you shut up or what? Hey! I heard that Lesnitsky did something. What happened? Nobody knows. Lesnitsky was at the lab. When the next shift came, the door was open and the lab ransacked. Lesnitsky was gone. Shit! So, what's inside? Chemical weapons, maybe some other shit. That's... that's all I heard. God damn it. The Colonel's going to tear me a new one because of Lesnitsky. A red-hot poker right into my soul. If I still have it. All right, let's go. We might control D6, but it's like a damn city down here. All the bunkers, the nooks and crannies and exits. Still, they base the order dream of finding it. They say cancer is strengthening the sentry points along the whole hey, line. Anyone Especially know what the, the buzz is about? The Why the summons? Krumman, take these guys to Miller. They've been summoned. Yes, sir. All right, go on in. I'll wait here. When you've gone, I'll speak to Miller. The bombing of the Dark Ones may have been humanity's worst mistake. What if they meant us no harm, but were trying to communicate? Perhaps the severe pain and loss of consciousness suffered in their presence just meant we were incompatible. Machines with different wiring. But somehow you, Artyom, have the common wire. The connection with the Dark Ones. Yes. People died at exhibition. Your home station. Hunter, the best of the order, is most likely dead as well. And he taught you this. If we don't fight for our lives in this new world, we'll be devoured. It is the law of evolution. But I would argue, the old laws no longer apply. All right, Artyom, and you, God, you have something to report? Yes, Colonel. Let's keep it short, then. I located the surviving Dark One at the gardens. What? One of those things is still alive? Luckily, yes. 
Luckily. Come, this is utter madness. The Dark Ones were the greatest threat the Orders ever faced. Come, just give me a chance. A single Dark One is no threat. Artyom has a gift. I believe he can establish contact with the creature. Let him come with me. All right. Artyom, go with Khan to the gardens and locate the Dark One. I'll send a sniper along. My best. Anna. Yes, sir. Why would we need a sniper? To eliminate the creature and finish the Orders' job. Miller, you can't! It's murder! Restrain him! You idiot! You're making the same mistake that... We're done here. Escort Khan out of here. Artyom! It's your last chance for forgiveness! For getting rid of the nightmares! Ah! Forget about Khan. Looks like he got close, too close to the creature and lost his mind. Look here, Artyom. Complete the mission and get back here quickly. A war is coming and I'll need every ranger at his post. On your way. So, what are you waiting for? Come along, rabbit. Artyom, if it's true that the Dark Ones can sense you, maybe you could draw it out from hiding so Anna can have a clear shot. But do me a favor. Don't let the Dark One get into your mind, or Anna will have two targets. Is that understood? We now suspect Lesnitsky was a sleeper agent, but we haven't verified who's running him. Your job is to intercept him before he delivers the stolen container. Don't tell me you believe that bullshit about making peace with the Dark Ones. I wish I had been up in that tower myself to see the missiles fall and watch them burn in their nests. Come on, Rabbit. Would you let those things into the Metro? Let them crawl into our brains so they could use us like animals. Maybe we could mate with them so the children could live on the surface and feed off the radiation. Shit. You don't shake hands with the devil. Please step away from the edge of the platform. Train coming in. We've worn this place out. Let's move. Just a year ago, I stood on top of the TV tower and saw missiles rain on the botanical gardens, turning the flesh into ashes, smelting metal and glass. Nobody and nothing could survive that inferno. Yet Khan did find the Dark One there. Now my mission is to find and eliminate it. To finish what I started. In the past, trains were ordinary things. But now, this monorail seems magic, doesn't it? Our kids won't know how to operate these things. And their kids will probably think this was built by the gods. All right, we've reached the station. This is part of the secret metro two line. We haven't explored these tunnels. We can't spare the time or manpower. So don't wander off. on the system and get the lights on. Use your flashlights in the meantime. Right. You ready? Watch. Watch yourself. The doors are closing. Good luck. Yeah, we'll need it. Didn't you and my father take the monorail when you went out to fire the missiles at the Dark One's nest? That's a good sign, Rabbit. Maybe we'll have luck with this mission, too. Power's working. Open the gate. I'll cover the passage. Great. You did fine after all.
All clear. Move out. All right. The map shows a collector entry point ahead. Move. I'm following. Go right. There's a dead end on the left. Something alarmed them. Stay sharp. Shit. That thing's fast. I don't think we'll run into anything serious here. Great. The ladder. It's just a little more walking. Then we'll see if you're a rabbit or a man. Surface. Put your mask on. Good looking at my ass. It's way out of your reach, rabbit. Give me a hand here. Let's go to the main entrance. There's a good shooting position there. I can cover a lot of territory. You're supposed to be immune to there. What? Influence? Well, I don't have your gift. So hop along, rabbit. Head on in and look for the creature. I'm thinking that since the Dark Ones are so fond of you, it'll sense you, or smell you, or whatever the fuck they do, and come from hiding. Just try to stay in the open so I can cover you. We'll maintain radio contact. And if you have second thoughts, don't worry. I'll do it. Okay then. Good luck. There's no way around. 